see two three things should be very clear real real clear clarity only can lead to the reality isn't it first thing is uh, you have to reach uh, to a supreme guru understand what is the meaning of it if your guru is not supreme how can he let you reach to the supreme it's our is is possible for us so i say you change any time guru that's not but you should have supreme guru whenever you have a guru it should be supreme i knew my there is no parallel for my guru nobody is there he alone exists and this became a realization so then only otherwise we are saying all the time god is everywhere then why do we need they are going to somebody who we knows no in his name this is the supreme so then it becomes much more uh, easier for us so these things are that's why every guru wants how the disciples associates progress fast because that is what they have come for and the thing is such that is a rate can be done in a very short period and when that is not uh, happening then time and again only we can say you know you should do you should try what else so it is a very delicate thing in that sense so so i put certain things what gurus will not do they will not tell anyone ever to commit suicide they will not tell anyone anything amoral such things are there then you have to then when such is the case then what else is left to consider another human being as supreme because if uh, sitting and that sees was is an one person is saying about himself consider me supreme never ever thinks this any guru if he thinks he is a guru he is no guru this idea crossing his mind that i can also be guru that time only you are born guru is only he who can ask the guru all name belongs to him what belongs to anybody else it is alone there is nobody else how can anybody else be the guru so that has to be understood in right that is why i say that uh, article i wrote in indian express nobody has come so far me to ask the real question from there it is not so i all the time i keep throwing 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 but uh, it is not going because the the question you uh, is asked then only i have a where with all to know okay, where you are and the way uh, what is my how can i look at you i say i do not look at your mind i look at your heart all the time that is my work that is my place now where else i can look but mind i tell neither i look i tell you also don't look anybody because if that were the case that is why people fall fell because this comes very easy to read somebody else's mind a well, very small technique you apply and you can read anybody you can uh, tell even beforehand what one is going to say it is not that is why one book i prescribed was paul brenton that first remove all these falsities what are you looking for second i said yoga basista one third i had told that i have now removed now two are still relevant third relevance is over one is to reach to the seeking become qualified seeker that is two things that removes those who are because the become any problem there from there once it is understood properly 
then this yoga assist it removes uh, your world that there is no such thing as world it is in confusion and that is where your gita begins arjun is confused everywhere in spirituality they begin with confusion that there is some confusion now that is what you go to your guru that i don't want confusion i want clarity and once you have received that clarity then hold on to it what happens is if you are not practicing then we cannot hold you have everything but you cannot hold it so by and by that needs to be hold it to what is your truth you have to hold on to it so meditation is the meditation you hold on to it through meditation yeah practice practice i would say practice yes whatever you understand practice do that because real question comes only with practice whatever you practice when you encounter something in that then only you say oh this is what so that is the practice see that i have told you very many time that once we are committed to a guru it is like tying yourself on the back of an elephant it is like that whether you know or not you are safe spiritually because you can know when you have become <laughs> a knower and when we can know so that is given that is why as you always have guru because there you are safe somebody has committed himself to us that your responsibility is mine that that way you have now what else remains you only have to realize and move that yes it is so that is why this is a wonderful device god so i mean so that is why people like kavi said then guru gobind do khade ka ke lago paaye bhale hari guru aapne gobind diyo bataye it has two meanings after realizing the god god only is in it this yes i have nothing i am nobody here you have somebody and it is another meaning it says guru govind dio batae because he made me to reach god so i go to him because god was already everywhere but i was looking here when i was not finding but somebody comes and looks look, this is the way to look at it then who is uh, more relevant that is the thing in our here in this land people preserved and this light has never extinguished it has always been there so that is called the guru parampara that when it becomes real for us then our uh, you call it progress you call it liberation and people call a revelation i say it's not a very big thing any time you can get liberated it is a child's play for that all the people say no you have to do this and that you to get liberation liberation means like free from death and birth this cycle oh. that is moksha moksha mm. but this guru parampara how come hmm. it's not given the importance very amazed like so much importance we have to education no okay sir child is 6 years old sent to school like that this guru parampara doesn't have any um no it's a importance this character is the issue some more degeneration certain and people could not maintain their character so it happened the generation it is important and still is in quarters we do not come to know it is not that is not there but that is the thing it was universal means in the sense numerically 
wide spread or full spread you can say whatever that was everywhere and now that has shrunk because of changes because people did not cope up with the change properly how it should transform they should not they did not do enough effort because it requires 100% commitment and uh, there is nobody who is pushing you for this it is some kind of self as you need you so that comes only with character and uh, degeneration happened with character now why uh, any system you see why should it not work if there is no corruption in it any system is there any system which is bad it is not because the moment you follow a system you will come to know its folly if you are honestly folly then you can correct it there is some problem in your correct and yeah, let it go like this that is uh, the issue so if gurus maintained that correct then it would not fall because that is how it is um, power centers change yesterday as we were talking oh that this order they even they, because character is gone then they do not have courage for a first victim of uh, the loss of character is courage you lose courage because after all you have courage so this they change the order if you listen to this the order is arth dharma ka moksha but people have said so many things because there is no such they do not know they did not realize they did not experience that it cannot happen another way so sutra is vidya dadati vinyam what is the evidence that you have got knowledge it makes you meek if you have not become meek and you have plethora of information you are not you did not get vidya knowledge so vidya dadati vidya dunya dadati patrottam when you have meekness then you become worthy so part patrottam patrottam dhana apnoti with worthiness comes dhana be it in a spiritual sense be in it becomes from there it becomes vidya patrottam dhana apnu dhana dharma tata sukha from earth what you do dharma that is the order arth dharma kaam moksha so first you need arth then you can follow dharma but what happens is in analytical mind applying they segregate it now first i will get arth i will do any hanky panky to get that and then i will do dharma that is what happening in your society yes that is it so before you have to move yes. same thing you are the one all you have to uphold so arth yes whatever you are earning it should go fully to the dharma that is the commitment what do you have got to do when you are saying you do not have this what for what is it have to be like that arth dharma then when that now who will put this idea somebody has to put this that is why guru parampara was there that everything came in the ashram and they said look i have touched this now let it go back that is all he wrote like no no system is maintained what were they were for not they were that they among what for are you amassing that for they were just sir i follow the system it is not kings it is like this it has to come in the ashram and then go to the coffer of the king now king also becomes subjugated because here the dependence on one another was such that nobody could commit mistake because everybody will depend on other for 
if it is rooted like this, the king is knowing it is not because of me, it is because of the ashram that it is coming. No, ashram is saying, no, it is not because of me, it is the king who is doing it properly, that is why people are in a position to run, earn money and give here. So it was such an end. If a warrior was given the weapon, then he was not given the sastra. No, you can't. Your role is some, because then dependence is at stake. So. Society has to be interdependent in the real sense. Then only it is a society. 